dần chiều kín dấu chân mỗi ngày phiên phân nhìn cùng bao nét chữ có hạt bụi trắng bay bay ánh mắt vẫn chiều mến yêu thương và giọng nói còn vắng ấm trong ngôi trường bên đàn em rêu bao khát vọng tuổi xanh Third person. Column one, I get up. Get up. But why get up? I have breakfast. She has breakfast. I do my work. She does her work. I go to bed. But she goes to bed. You can see that that in column one we keep the verbs, but in column two we add s r e s ending to the verb. That's the way we use the verb in the present simple tense. The present simple tense is due to express a habit or an action repeated regularly. For example, I usually get up early. She often plays badminton in the afternoon. Now, I'm telling you about the narrative form. I don't play badminton in the afternoon, and we do the same as the subject do we say of plural now. You don't play badminton. We don't play badminton. They don't play badminton. The second example. He doesn't play badminton in the afternoon. We do the same as a subject. She, it, are singular now. He doesn't play badminton in the afternoon. And now the question for: Do you watch TV in the evening? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Uh, do they watch TV in the evening? Yes, they do. Uh, uh, no, they don't. The second example: Does he watch TV in the evening? And the answer: Yes, he does. Uh, no, he doesn't. Or uh, does she watch TV in the evening? Yes, she does. Oh no, she doesn't. In order to remember this, I have a small exercise for you. Let's work in group of four. Complete the sentences using provided words. The provided words are go. Girls, yes, are are ladies. Let's work in group, please. Two minutes for you. Yes, yes. Yes. Have you got your answer? Move on, please. 
weekend I easily go shopping with my mother. It never ends up late. They study at primary school. They often play football in the afternoon. Nam and Tom has lunch at school. You are good school. Clap your hands, please. And I would like you to do another exercise. Work in groups in the verse, in the brackets, in the correct form. About four minutes for you. Are you clear? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Have you got your answers? Have you got your answers? Yes or no? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, group six, please. Group six, please. It's a morning. Linda gets up early. She is free. Goes shopping. After breakfast, she runs by to school. After school, she on way to her homework. In the afternoon, she sometimes plays badminton. On Sunday morning, Linda and her mother go shopping. Uh, at weekend, her family visit their parents in the countryside. They go home late in the evening. You are certain. Clap your hand, please. And now it's time for you to write a short paragraph. Short passage. Passage is from seven sentences to ten sentences about daily activities of your family member. Passage should begin like this. Every morning, my brother, or sister, or father, or mother. About uh, five minutes for you. Are you clear? Yes. 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 Okay, let's start. Con người vẫn có học đâu, con cầm vào cái điện thoại là con cứ mấy cái thằng rồi vỡ vẫn vẫn. Con không nghe, con chỉ nghe cái đấy đâu. Thế con bảo một tiếng nói con 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 nghe rồi sao nó không không rồi? Yes. Yes. Can you read? Okay. Can you read? Okay. 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 Yes. Okay. Every morning, my mother gets up early. Then she does exercise and has breakfast at 7 a.m. She goes to work at 7.30 a.m. in the afternoon. She goes to home at 4.30 p.m. in the evening. She cooks dinner at 7 p.m. Yeah. And now she goes to bed at 10 p.m. That's all. Thank you. I see that you can write a complete passage. It can use the correct form of the verb. But I think you should improve your pronunciation later. All right? Okay, thank you. And here is my suggested answer. Can you read aloud? Yes, please. Every morning, my brother Tom gets up early. She does morning exercise and then he has black earth. He often has black and eggs or black earth. He go to school at six thirty. School start at seven thirty and finish at four thirty. 
He goes home at 5 p.m. After school, he plays football. He also helps my mother cook dinner. After dinner, we talk together and send from his homework. He goes to bed at night. Thank you. And now we go on for our lesson is the next task. I have a question. Number one, what do they do on Sundays? Two, does she ride a bike to school? What does your mother do in the afternoon? Let's work in pairs. I'm going to read you. Yes. Yes. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Ready. Can you say loud your speaking? Yes. And my please. What do yes. you do on Saturday? On Sunday, sorry. I play football. Does he like a Bye to school. Yes, she does. What does your mother do in the afternoon? She cooks dinner. Thank you. I see that you you understand the question and the answer. Uh, best. Remember, what do they do? So we should uh, answer very plain. Very plain. Not uh, yes. Yes. Be careful later. Be more careful later. And the next task for you. Let's work in pairs. Ask answer about hobby, habits, the routine of yourself, your friends, and your family. And I have some suggestions for you. You should prepare in two or three minutes. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Ready. Let's speak loud. Yeah, and yeah, please. Yes. Okay. What time do you often get up in the morning? I often get up about 6.30 a.m. What do you do after get up? Getting up. Mm, I am um, usually brush my teeth. Yes. What time do you have breakfast? At seven a.m. What do you usually do in the afternoon? Mm, in the afternoon, I usually um, cook dinner. For my family. Yeah. And in the evening? Mm, well, in the evening, I am uh, watch TV and um, go to bed. Yes. What about from father? Oh, my mother usually go to bed uh, early. Thank you. Thank you very much. Both of you have tried your best, but you should try to remember the question. You should learn by heart the question. You shouldn't stare at my suggestion like you are reading, not speaking. All right? right. Okay. Yes. Before ending the lesson today, let's play a game. Would you like to play a game? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We are going to play the 
example is we have let's read the room. Do you understand the rule? Yes. Yes. Now oh, let's play. Question one. Team one. Hey. Hey. Question two. Team two. B. 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 Hey, hey, hey. 